Okay, part two of uh, 9.1. So let's, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to create a new R script file that we can write all of our wonderful code into. Let's go add file, R scripts. Uh, I'm going to do control and S to save it. And I'm just going to save this as um, too many. That's just to be consistent. And that's a dot R, okay? Okay, now... I've got a lot to worry about here, okay? So before um, I even think about trying to extract um, sort of the gradients for these uh, for this, these data sets, I first need to be able to prepare all of the file names that I'm gonna ask R to look at and then feed them into some sort of loop, okay? Um, right, so to do that in R, I'm gonna create a variable called DIR, which stands for directory, and that is simply going to be um, the location of the folder we're working on relative to where our, our proj file is, okay? So in this case, and you can look at your path name here, uh, you've got uh, week 9, oh, we're in the folder called week 9, week underscore 9, uh, and this this will this will be different for you depending on what you've called your folders, okay? Um, but it's going to be uh, nine, one, uh, two, many elephants, and then I'm going to be looking in this folder called lots of elephants. That's where all my data is. Okay, I'm going to control and enter that. Just to check, just, all I've done here is to find a string essentially. If I if I spit that out at the bottom here, it's just this string: week nine, um, nine one, too many elephants, lots of elephants. Okay. What I'm going to ask R to do now is essentially create a list um, of all the files in that directory. Okay, so I'm going to create a new variable called files, and I am going to simply use this function which is called list um, dot files and I'm going to use the variable I've defined above called dir and I'm going to do control and enter and you can see now I've got um, actually I'm just going to reset these a second run that again run that again right so I've now got um, a files variable which has a thousand file names in it. Okay, I can prove that if I just print out those files again. There you go. Right, one, two, uh, a thousand. I don't know why is it, oh yeah, there, it is. there is a thousand there, okay. Um, okay, 